perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. We have terrific scenes in front of us at the Estadio do Dragao, one of the biggest venues in Portugal. And if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Gets wrestled off the ball. Forward it goes. Delaney. Hoiberg. Christensen. And it's played forward. Uh, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Denied by a great piece of goalkeeping. Absolutely terrific, terrific reflexes. Goalkeeping at its very best. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Delaney battles to win it back. Seems now to be all about width. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. Tolberg unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Ball's gone out of play. And it's Heuberg. Hoiberg, he hits it, an absolute thunderbolt, sumptuous finish, an absolute joy, and Denmark score first. Absolutely thundered in, keeper no chance. That is just the top drawer finish, he was always in control and couldn't have placed it any better. Denmark have an early lead. Good start. Tries to locate someone up front. Ball is over the line. That's great strength on the ball. Schick! He's pulled off a fine save. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. Kufal plays it forward. Schick. Oh, the ball's come loose and they've been caught out here. Towering header. Oh, denied brilliantly. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Schick really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Kufal. Schick. Schick spreads it towards the left. He's gone for it. Tries one. Back of the net. He was so alert to the possibilities there. Great stuff. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top-notch.
The Czech Republic grab the equaliser and we're all square. Oh, look, Peter, there's a great... Eb Tries a shot! Goal! Denmark! And they get themselves in front! It is a good finish. The odds were against him. Little matter. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked a scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business, that. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. Looks to bypass the midfield. Marla gets it back. He's got options out wide. That is going out for a goal kick. <laughs> Delaney plays it forward. Tries to get it clear. Vass tries to switch the play. Delaney. And now they can launch a counter. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Hit long and direct. He gets past his man. Schick. Good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Tries to get it forward quickly. And there's the end of the first half. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial so it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period well it's still anyone's game as, as both sides have shown they have goals in them as for the next one should it arrive um, that may have a bigger bearing as to who emerges victorious Denmark leading by one in a finely poised game it is intriguing to watch and could easily go either way. And if you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Hoiberg. Oh, some tackle that. Schick, good challenge, he just stood firm. Heiberg drives it forward. More than happy to take the muscular approach. No question, that's a foul. Effort, but no way through. Hoists it forward. And it's played forward. He's made sure that that won't get through. And that is as far as they're going to go. Hits one! 
Oh, shame, that was nicely worked. The timing of the pass and run was exquisite. Tolberg, a scorer already in the game. Schick. Chance! Well, this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. Marla. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Oh, that's a waste. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Forward it goes. Uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Header gets it away. It's being played forward. That's not going to make it. The Czech Republic are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. And he's there to hoof it away. And the weighted pass. That's gone a long way up and away. Hoiberg. Time to deliver. He's gone down, but the referee just tells him to get back up again. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Hoiberg. Helps available out wide. And that has been clubbed away. Denmark probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. It is just a question of running down the clock now. Kia. And there goes the final whistle. Denmark, winners by the odd goal. It really could have gone either way, but a win is a win. Well, what are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? Yeah, we knew there was a sizable gap.